In this video, I will be sharing about installing DeepCam to get started locally. We highly recommend using DeepCam in a new virtual environment so that it will be easier to manage dependencies and packages. Here I will be using Conda as my environment manager. So let us first create a new Conda environment for DeepCam. Once an environment is created, we activate the environment to get started with installing packages. DeepCam uses deep learning, deep learning frameworks like TensorFlow or PyTorch or JAX for backend purposes. So during installation, you have to use DeepCam with a specific backend. So in case you are installing DeepCam in CPU, you can specify the backend which you would like to use during install. Like pip install DeepCam and then mention the package which you would like to use. TensorFlow or Torch or JAX. In this case, I will be using Temchar Torch for demonstration purposes. In case you are using ZShell, you will be required to, to mention the package name in quotes because ZShell takes the square brackets for pattern matching. In case you are using DateCam with GPU, you first you are first required to make sure that CUDA is enabled in your machine. Then you need to first install the backend and then install DateCam. So the installation for of the backend like PyTorch or JAX is uh, are available in their websites. So for TensorFlow, you can visit tensorflow.org slash install. For PyTorch, you can visit this page. And for JAX, you can visit JAX installation guidelines. Let's say you are choosing PyTorch. In that case, you need to choose the PyTorch installation procedure with respect to your CUDA version. And then install PyTorch. And then I will first install the backend. And then I will install the cam using it. So to install the nightly version, you can use the pre option. Otherwise, you can just use pip install the cam for installing the latest stable version. This will help you in getting started with the cam. So the cam is used for multiple scientific applications like molecular machine learning or applying deep learning to material sciences and for other applications like bioinformatics, quantum chemistry and so on. Two of the packages which will be helpful for getting started with deep chem in molecular machine learning and material science are RDKit and PyMatchen. RDKit is used for using deep chem for molecular machine learning purposes and it can be installed using pip as in pip install RDKit Pi Pi. In case you need to use DeepCam for material science applications, you can install the package PyManchan of version 2020.1. This will help you get started with using DeepCam for material science applications. So once the installation gets completed, we are good to start with using DeepCam for machine learning and other deep learning applications in science. So let's import DeepCam and check the version which we have installed. In 
in the next tutorial i will be sharing about on getting started with deepcam with some small examples of using deepcam